We're on the way to Novartis now to demand that they stop strangling the supply of affordable medicines from India to the developing world. Novartis has been locked in an ongoing legal battle with India for the last six years over the rejection of a patent for a cancer drug. All clues led me to deduce that it was Novartis in the Indian Supreme Court with greed. Novartis' behaviour is disgraceful. India supplies 80% of generic medicines to the developing world. It's unacceptable that Novartis is trying to strangle this supply. Novartis should be ashamed of themselves. Shame on you, Novartis! Shame on you! Shame on you! Shame on you! Shame on you! This case is about a cancer drug, but the wider impact is going to negatively affect lots of people in the developing world. Indian patent law allows for the rejection of patents on drugs that aren't deemed to be new innovations, on drugs that are existing products which have had slight modifications. It's a process known as evergreening that the pharmaceutical industry uses to continually extend the patent monopolies on their drugs, and it keeps them priced out of reach for poor people. It's a deliberate attempt by Novartis to undermine and weaken India's patent system in order to maximise their profits. We can't allow corporate greed to put millions of lives at risk. We must stop Novartis.